tis the season to be jolly. Ah, la 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 la. Absolutely love Christmas. I remember Christmas in Madras. We had a wonderful tailor who would stitch me a special Christmas dress for the Christmas service at 11. On Boxing Day, Daddy would go to play golf at the Gymkhana Club. We would meet him afterwards for a bowl of malagatawny soup, which I later found out was excellent for his hangover. We would sit on the veranda overlooking the lawn. I would have bread and butter pudding. Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip came to visit the club once. And of course, we had a wonderful New Year's Eve fancy dress party at the club. And sometimes the vicar would dress up as a clown as a special treat. When I went to boarding school, I would have Christmas, Granny Bullstrops. My brother Bertie would come if he behaved. Mummy and Daddy would send us a Christmas card from Madras. I remember one with a photograph of Madras Central Station, Buckingham Canal, and a red satin bow. Granny Bullstrops staff would make the most wonderful Christmas Day lunch. Red sauce and <laughs> Yorkshire pudding, crackers and red tug of war, <laughs> mint spies, and of course the plum pudding, covered in brandy and lit on fire. I love Christmas carols. I prefer male carolers, of course. God rest ye merry gentlemen. We three kings of Orient are. The holly and the ivy. <laughs> in the bleak midwinter, good King Wenceslas, once in Royal David's city, joy to the world.